this is the day I'm going to be letting my spider go back into the wild before it gets too much colder out. And this is this particular spider. Let's see if you can see her. I think it's a female in the jar here. This particular female is known as a bullheaded sack spider. So I'm gonna see if I can get her out for one last holding and then we're gonna turn her loose back into the wild. I love the uh, red colored legs on this spider and it has that uh, grayish oh, washed out look to its abdomen. There's a couple of uh, indentations there and you can actually see where the heart is on the back of the abdomen. Uh, the little area of discoloration that runs right down uh, center line if you were to draw one uh, from top to bottom of the abdomen. and. Uh, I'm told, I haven't had a chance to do this yet, but I'm told on some spiders you can, if you watch it very carefully enough and have enough magnification, you can watch the heart actually beat under the skin of the abdomen or the exoskeleton to be proper terminology. Well, here's one more look at the girl.
I think she's enjoying the warmth of my wrist here. And uh, it's not going to be so nice where I'm going to place her because the ground will be a little colder than my... Uh, There you go, girl. Freedom. At last. Fun to film up close, but also a lot of fun to let them go back into the natural wild that they're used to. And uh, this one still has plenty of time to uh, winterize itself if it's going to do that. So, hey, thanks for watching. And as always, I appreciate you tuning in. Have yourself a great day. Take care now. Bye-bye.